dirty pop. You can't stop. How much I like this? Do you hear the game? Yeah. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Just had to make sure that you heard all that. I bet you like this dirty pop. Boom, boom, boom. So, why you gotta try and classify the types of things we do? Just trying to know what I can be saying the same for you. Well, that one's going on the list. <laughs> they won't hear it because we haven't started the episode yet, so bam. How do you know? I know because I edit these things. <laughs> nah, don't be a coward. Edit it in. I will not. Edit it in. <laughs> oh my god. This is a very nice, peaceful um, opening screen. Hey, yo, we back. Is there audio on this opening screen? No. Okay, just making sure. <laughs> Ayo, we back. Ayo, we back. Uh, <laughs> Once again, it's we, the boy Jello. We got, we got, we got, we got. <laughs> got it. Um, <laughs> we got got. That's what happened. Yeah, we got opera du- opera boy Jello and dragged sword boy Spire. <laughs> <laughs> Dope. <laughs> Uh, your input is needed to expedite relief in case of emergency. Am I getting Nigerian scammed in the future? All right, listen. It's been about Everybody's two months since I seen this. <laughs> game. You, you gotta tell me what's going on. Uh, I opened up a cut off in terminal, and it's now saying immediate response requested. All right, central authority urges all individuals to provide relocation preference as soon as possible. Uh, you wanna go narrow or wide? Go wide. Ah. Stupid. Oh, Alright, well, our boy's still drunk. Oh, All right. <laughs> we're still in, in drunk land? Yeah. <laughs> so. Oh, that uh, that felt like years ago. Yeah, I, it was just two seconds ago. You think maybe... I don't know, but it's time to destroy these things. Whoa, the boss is Snapshot 3.0. Oh, what is oh, this? Oh, God. Oh, I think that I found... I right, man, this song is stuck in our head forever. Where's where's the cheerleader? Take my picture. Smack my picture. All right, cool. I right, now remember how to play this game again. Let's go. <laughs> do you remember how to take my picture and smack my bitch up? Uh, where was the first time you heard that song? I don't know. I was like 10 or some shit. <laughs> Cause the first time I heard that song was in a little old video called um, Charlie's Angels. That's probably where. I, that's, <laughs> that's probably where. I'm gonna Google it. Take my picture, smack my, and then I just let it. Let it. Uh, this that is a uh, smack my bitch up by the Prodigy. I I do love me some Prodigy. Uh, well, it's a song by English rave group The Prodigy, released in November 1997. Oh, hey! <laughs> it's the third and final single off their third album, The Fat of the Land. Yo, you're telling me <laughs> not only was it these people's third album, this was the third single off the third album. Where the other two had to be heat if this is like the third one. <laughs> the Prodigy make bangers. What up? Name one other song they had. Um, what you call it? The Warrior Within. Nope. The Prodigy. Listen, I don't know nothing. Uh, yeah. <laughs> um, Omen. They had bangers. Uh, um, I forget the name of the song, but it's like it goes, "Come with me to the dance floor, you and me," because that's what it's for. Well. The song caused considerable controversy because of its suggestive title and explicit music video, which depicted scenes of drunken and drug-fueled sexual assault and violence. Damn. Huh. In 2010, it was voted the most controversial song of all time. Yikes. That's pretty good. Alright, sorry. I'm concentrating and trying to remember how to play this game. 
fair. <laughs> and it's hard. Because <laughs> I'm getting my butt killed handed to me. Alright, where, where, the, where are the things that shoot? No, 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 I'm going to die! And I lost. Bounce. Got it. Well, it went gold in um, Canada, New Zealand, and the UK. I told you, they made bangers. Yeah, gold. Anybody could go gold. Get out of here. Got it. Oh, they played my song a hundred times. Here's a gold medal. You're you're the worst. <laughs> <laughs> what you mean? You know exactly what I mean. Alright, but what genre would you call that? Uh Judging the prodigy? You're wrong. The prodigy? I, I don't know because there's so many like subgenres of fucking electronic music, so I'm gonna safely say subgenic electronic music. Take the coward's route. It's big beat and techno. Come on. Okay. You got it. You don't know about big beat? I, I know about the fresh beat. She know about the fresh beat band. Um Listen man. <laughs> Big beat is like um, it's like heavy break beats, synthesizer loops. Okay. It's like acid house and techno, but it's a little different. Okay. Think, think like uh, Fat Boy Slim, propeller heads. I miss me some Fat Boy Slim. Yeah, that's 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 big beat. Uh, the style began to decline in 2001 though. Well, big sad. Kind of like, um, what's it called? Um, garage music? Yo, I like me some garage music. Yeah, so, yeah. Do, so do I. But yeah, you know, it is a... Why are we here again? About what? Why, why did we get to the Prodigy and electronic music? Um, because the snapshot took a picture of you. And I said, oh, take yeah. my picture. You did, you smack did. my bitch this is your fault. You, you thought I was gonna speak about this video game? <laughs> My fault. Yeah, yeah. Let me just die. <laughs> My fault. All good, all good. Um, you know, musical history is fun, especially when you get into like the not so uh, distant past. Okay. Uh, because like you know, we could talk about like. Charleston's and all, all those old types of songs that aren't here anymore but when you get into like stuff people still remember and you're like yeah no nah, that's a defunct music genre like it's like damn just like fine. just a decade ago we were listening to dubstep <laughs> where is dubstep now where is Skrillex every time I hear dubstep now i'm like man this is this is that's like a literal phase like i like i understand the concept Yo, of the just like rip <laughs> that dubstep had on the youth <laughs> 10 years ago. like i understand like how like 80s music is a phase and like 90s music is a phase and like disco was a phase like i understand that no nah, disco's not dead no it's not well no it was dead it's coming back but uh like i understand that right but yeah. like the active of like living through the beginning and end of a phase <laughs> crazy <laughs> all right this is new um enables a second upgrade slot for an active slot opens the next passive slot for use with any with any function or allows more functions to be in say simultaneously okay so i can get four memory which means yeah. i could use bark again true that'd be pretty cool or i can get a passive slot do you have a passive slot now or no I have one. Uh, and then there's an upgrade slot. Uh, I think... I think I'm going with memory. It's just, crazy. I like Bark. Bark is very useful. I love you so much, right? Oh my oh, god! Oh, you're drunk, sword. It's true. You're drunk. It's true. His Kurt Angle moment. How could you love me? It's true. You don't even know me. <laughs> he knows you're not. Just some crazy fog I've never seen before. Nothing to be Famous last words, bro. Well, that was said to me in real life. What? <laughs> Nothing to be afraid of? Was some crazy ass. No. <laughs> uh, you, you, how could you love me? You don't even know me. Who, who said that to you? Excuse me. <laughs> you know, a person in the past 
where I'm like, oh man, yeah, that was silly. That that is that's like a movie that I that's like a line that I only thought was like, oh, what was that? What? Was what was that? Yeah, yeah, me and the drunk person on the same page. I love that for me. Um, <laughs> mm, never mind. <laughs> this guy. To uh, be fair, I was about as drunk as the sword. So. Sure. Okay, but like that is that is a line that I only expect to hear in rom coms. Only. That's so funny. Like, like, how could you love me? You don't even know me. Excuse, ma- <laughs> ma'am. <laughs> Fuck. It's fine. You ever accidentally said I love you too soon? Um. No. Nice. Good for you. Honestly. <laughs> uh. Well, I mean, because the thing is. Oh boy. <laughs> Yes, please give me the spire lore. <laughs> I'm super excited. It's it's not lore. It's it's. <laughs> it could be lore, but we're not gonna make it lore. Um, <laughs> I love that. The the thing is, sword. I'm trying to tell a story. Uh, feelings happen to people, right? Okay. And. The whole, like, gradual, oh, I learned to love this person after months and months of, every like... Time, every time you cast a vote in this town, <laughs> it gets tally, sorted, mm-hmm. somewhere here. Yeah. I'm listening. I think you you know early, is is what I'm gonna say. Oh, okay. I feel like the whole saying it too early thing is more like a another chance to make Cloud um, Bank a better place. A symptom of like the world we live in, where it's like nobody wants to be the loser. You know, Real love quick, is war. Are we suffering from fever, forgetfulness, fatigue, or skin pallor? Yes. Okay, fatigue it is. Continue. All right, Just so. Need to get some rest. Mm-hmm. We're gonna die. Seems like you're safe. Oh? I take full credit. <laughs> <laughs> My drunk guy. Uh, I'm gonna do some tests while you continue to regale me about some love. Um, one of those doors. Those doors. Uh, <laughs> He's gonna turn not drunk real quick. <laughs> yeah. We're back to normal. Yeah. So um, it's. I feel like you just know. And, uh, um, with you if I could. Hi, Luna. That's our girl. Woof. Oh, uh, yeah, that's about it. That's the story. No doubt. I don't, I don't really think there is a too soon because of the way emotions work. Okay. There's something out You're there. not just gonna be like, at the towers. Give me, give me a, give me, give me a year. <laughs> I think, I think I'll figure it out by then. I'll it's get to hours. it. But I mean, then again, everybody's different, you know? Right, right, right. So I guess what I meant by that section is, have you, well, that question was, have I, have you ever said I love you and then someone was like, not ready for that? Oh yeah, of course. Okay. Oh, that's better for you. So sorry. So sorry, friend. Uh, I guess we're doing planning. It was like, hey, you know, this is how I feel. <laughs> wrong decision, uh, buddy boy. <laughs> no, it wasn't the wrong decision. It was just like. That person had to ascertain their 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 joint, and they got back to me in a couple months or whatever. <laughs> no doubt. In one turn. Oh, oh. they're uh, pretty spread. What what is that ping? Yeah. Oh, but it kills in one. Yeah. Right, so you just ping them up. Looks like there might be some walking involved. Luckily. Ping is pretty cheap. Is that all of them? Don't know. Gotta be. Go for it. You, you Did him? I miss one? Yeah. How? You never How? shot at him. Oh, or sway. Maybe you shot at him, but like it hit a wall. Sway, sway. I got, I got issues. Okay. Yeah. But yeah. All right. Well, yo, saying I love you is hard, bro. Why? Uh, well, as a person who does not like acknowledging their feelings, that. Mm. But also, 
I'd be like, I had like, I'm, I'm like one of those dudes who had one bad experience and then you're just like, all right, well, never again. Like, Aww, like, trauma. never again. Yeah, yeah. Love that for you. <laughs> do we? Do we love that? I guess the the growth is great. Um, yay, get to play the cat litter box. But um, yeah, I don't know. I've had, I've definitely had it the other way around when someone was like, yeah, I love you, and I was like, oof. <laughs> <laughs> And, and you know, you know, door two again. Um, it's like hard because a lot of people use the word use the word love, like in my opinion, incorrectly. Mm. Uh, and like I, the way I see the word love is just like it is for like good. intimate people, like 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 people tell their friends, "Oh my god, I love you" and stuff like that. I'm like, I'm sure that's the type of love, but I would never say that unless I've known someone for like so long. You know, oh. so it's just like that's oh. a, time for some keep. That's a pretty. Uh... Oh, they put dash on the wrong button. <laughs> Why do I have a copy? Oh god, I'm gonna die. What is this? I'm gonna die so hard. Being a being a, a Japanese. Um, where are you going with this? <laughs> you. <laughs> I understand, but like, uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, like you know that they they have like four words for love. Yeah. So I'm just a little surprised that you have that that um point of view. Well, I didn't. When like you you know that there's different uses of it because of that words. For you. Yeah, but I didn't grow up Japanese like. As much as I, I love my grandmother and stuff like that, you know, I didn't see her a lot like that. I didn't really learn the language until I was, like, a teenager or adult. And I'm still learning the language, you know, so, like... Yeah, I the culture is different. Um, yo, you gotta live. You got Oh, don't get barked on. I have 14 seconds. There's no way this happens. Nah, just live. Oh, oh. Hey, buddy. I love how they gave me three things. I'm only using one. Whose fault is that? Mine, hundred percent. Oh my god, Ooh, baby! Yo, that wolfer was on your ass. <laughs> That's why I can't wait to have him back on the team. Water wall. <laughs> um. Yeah, man. Yeah, I don't know, man. Love is weird. Anyway. Yeah. I love you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Love you too, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> it says how much he does not say in the word. You know, it's fine. Let's uh, how you been, Spire? Because, you know, it's like 15 minutes into this episode uh, and I'm just asking you how you are. Finally. <laughs> fucking asked me how I You're the one who started searching up the fucking prodigy on the internet, my man. <laughs> how do you know that was on the internet? Because you, uh, you, 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 you didn't know any fucking prodigy songs like Firestarter or Omen. I'm not crazy. Your starter. And you know what's crazy? I I could Prodigy seems like a band you'd be into. Yeah. Uh, oh See, shit. I'm fucking... I'm um always on my music discovery um journey. And there's no end point. Right. And um the path sometimes may surprise you. Fight on. So all that to say is it's not that I missed oh. the stop. It's just maybe I didn't get there. Yeah. Please stop. He only has one pop. Oh, because it's the cop. And, and then he does that. Shadow. I'm gonna die. Um, super question. Yeah? How do you feel about Shadow the Hedgehog? <laughs> <laughs> I feel like Shadow is a character that is misrepresented because the internet got a hold of him. And thus, he is not allowed to be the character he truly wants without reminding people of a meme. Which meme would that be? Um, hey, I am Edgelord McEdgelord, and, you know, and gun. <laughs> but is he not a gun-twitting Edgelord? Yes, but, like, he's, he's, there's a reason why he exists, and it's not to be a gun-toting Edgelord. Do I know it? No, but I'm part of the meme culture. <laughs> it's supposed to be a toy for the main character. It's not a game. You don't 
don't have to hit them. You just have to collect them. Oh, you... It's been so long. <laughs> now they're bad souls. That's fine. While I'm frozen, I can shoot them all. Whoa. It's like the one mission he just did when he did this. Yeah, yeah. But like... And then you I missed one. one. Oh. Again, like the last time. It's fine. At least you're consistent. Yeah, yeah, yeah 100%. Do I get my health back? That'd be oh. really cool. Yes! yes. Shut up. <laughs> is that bounce? Hell yeah it is. Hell yeah it is. Wish I had a dash. That'd be that'd be pretty fucking swell. But yeah, man, I don't know, man. There's a bunch of like wasted uh Did that I was like, what just died? Um potential with certain characters like you know like oh yeah like it's like the the, the way i feel about shadow of the hedgehog is the way i feel about like villains turn playable characters in any type of video game they are so broken and now it like when you were a villain in the boss battle you you just like struggle like eight thousand times to beat it and then you finally beat the boss is like all right cool i'm gonna do the shonen thing where i join your team now and it's like all right cool swell and it's like it he sucks this person sucks they ain't crap uh, you know, the villain turned playable character is one archetype, right? Yeah. Different archetype, which is also as bad. Yes. Is the, uh, the pre, the pre-evolved, uh, early game unit that doesn't scale well and becomes trash by the end game. Oh, so Frederick. Yes. <laughs> Uh, Frederick and Titania? Was that her name? From what? Is it the same game? What is um, Titan Titan Titania from? From Fire Emblem. Oh, uh, uh, which Fire Emblem then? I'm trying to remember. Yeah. Um, I want to say Path of Radiance. Uh, I think that's it, but unsure. Don't remember. Fly. It's like. Yeah, look how strong this unit is. Don't use them. It's a waste of experience. <laughs> I, I like the complete opposite. You, did you ever play Fire Emblem Awakening? Yes. Yeah, so you remember Donald? Yes. Yeah, that guy who has a broken-ass progeny? Yeah. Um, Very hard to recruit him on your team. But if you do, man, he's stupid. It's just like, yeah, uh, if you fish experience into me, I will... Oh. Just, just to see if we're on the same. That's the the farmer boy, right? Yes, 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 yes. yes, yeah, yes yeah, 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 yeah. Oh man, what a god! Yeah, <laughs> he's like, hey, uh, listen. Uh, all right, all right. I will get one tapped. <laughs> Don't leave me in danger. But if 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 you do if you do this right, and you get me, you know, into some a couple of good scraps, you get me to level ten. And I level up. Hello. No, no fear. No fear for the end game. Yeah, hundred percent. It's insane. Yeah, <laughs> like the 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 progression level of Donald is insane. Which is, but I I also love that game because there was like so many options of just like that you can lose yourself in just like trying to make the perfect progeny mm -hmm. because you know. Anytime a game goes into time travel. By the way, this game goes into time travel for people who do not know clearly. Um, but any game that goes into time travel is obviously going to do something stupid. And this one was like, hey, we come from the future and we're your kids of whoever you marry each other. And your kids just automatically get all of your fucking um, abilities. So, you know. Yeah, it was real dumb. <laughs> Just, just have fun with it, because, uh... What a shot. And it was like, we thought it couldn't get more Persona. Remember when we thought it was like, wow, this is a game is so Persona. I'm just telling you right now. And then three houses come. <laughs> <laughs> as a person... And they're in a real school. As a person who played, um... Tokyo Mirage Sessions. Yeah. Which is the combination of Fire Emblem and Persona, or Shin Megami Tensei at least. You're like, yeah, it's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I understand exactly where this is going. And, uh... No sessions. We're Mirage. Yeah, and, um, I was like... 
that game isn't even like full potential how can we fuse these games and make, just make it so obnoxious but casual um, the next fire Emblem was uh, announced to yesterday or today oh see I, i'm not watching the in the directs man yeah so oh um, what else we also got a title for uh breath of the wild 2 Mm -hmm. It's no longer called Breath of the Wild 2. <laughs> Good to it's, know. Uh, Tears of the King. Got it. I think is the name. I could look it up and confirm, but I don't want to. Um, Tears of the King or Tears of the Kingdom? One of those two. Um, that's cool. Uh, Pikmin 4 announced. Pikmin 4. That's Pikmin cool. Pikmin 4. Um... A lot, a lot happening in the, these N Nintendo streets. That's really exciting. Uh, you know what? I said I wasn't gonna look it up. Uh, I'm gonna look it up. <laughs> Alright. So, Tears of the Kingdom coming May 12th, 2023. That's uh, Breath of the Wild? Yeah. Pikmin 4 announced. Uh, Fire Emblem Engage announced. Engage? Yeah. Uh, the return of Marth. Oh no! <laughs> I was, yeah, I was like, "Yo, Marth has been dead for decades." <laughs> what do you yeah. mean? He never even came out in English, bro. Oh Get my off of god! Me. Give me more Ike. I don't need more. Oh, you killed nah, my. We got like five games of Ike. It's okay. We <laughs> we, we got it. We get. We. You know what? Actually, you're right. Give me more Robin. I actually really liked Robin. Robin was cool. Yeah, I liked Robin, but that's just because I have like the, the disgusting boner for Tharja, so God. Uh, uh I also liked Fates, but I don't need a sequel of that. Fair, fair, fair. Um Golden Eyes coming. Holy sh y'all all need to die. Octopath two. That's that's announced. I should probably play one. I started it uh really pretty. Right, that's, right. That's all I got for it. Um Kirby's Return to Dreamland Deluxe. Uh, you know, a uh, 2D Kirby game, so that's great. I mean, we, we, we enjoy Kirby. But it takes two is coming to Switch. Oh, you know what that means. I mean, we could have already been playing we it, but. already did it. Like, yeah. Uh, Tales of Symphonia Remaster. Uh, that's the one with Lloyd and Rain. Um, and, um, what system is that coming out for? Switch. Oh, it's over. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I the, ch am... the channel will be seeing that. All right. Let's go. All right. I told, I told you my story. Of, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, of so if anything, rabbit. we gotta play it to avenge you. Yeah, for sure. Uh, Tunic is coming to Switch, which I already was gonna get on PlayStation, but now that it's also coming to Switch, I might get it there. I'm not sure. Right. Um, it's gonna be kind of. Uh, Kind of Death's Door ish. Exciting. Um, Nintendo Switch Sports gets its golf update soon. Ooh. Exciting. Please! Uh, the Advance Wars oh, okay. uh, remake has been delayed. So that, that that's awful. <laughs> <laughs> you don't like Advance Wars? No, it's awful that it um is delayed. Oh, delayed. Okay, I didn't hear the word. My bad. Yeah. Uh, uh, there's a Square Enix game called Various Daylife coming out. Okay. Um. And I saw I saw that as like a uh, a headline. There's a game called Various Daylife coming out. <laughs> Jesus Christ, right? Right. What I also just saw now. Mm -hmm. Yo, don't buy that game. Oh, boy. It's a port of an iOS game that failed miserably <laughs> three years ago. <laughs> I was like, damn. Big sides. Um, let's, they showed off some more Bayonetta 3. Okay. Uh, they showed off uh, some Crisis Core. Let's see what you got. Some uh, Rune Factory. Some more uh, Mario Kart uh, tracks. Uh, you know, I was thinking of like purchasing that DLC. Wonder if I should. 
Like, I mean, it's more more of the same. Yeah, but I mean, that I haven't played every single Mario Kart game, right? Like, I'm one of those people who will die on the hill that Double Dash was the best Mario Kart game, right? And then um, I ha- I didn't play a lot of the stuff for the mobile devices. I did play the new one. I mean, I own the new one, but you know, so like, there's a bunch of maps that I've literally never played that I could like purchase. But you know, like I also didn't own a Super Nintendo, so I didn't really. The only tracks I really get to play that I remember from Super Nintendo, there's like a borderline farm one. Oh, he's drunk again. Um, and there's like a the Rainbow Road and the Bowser's Mansion. So you know, I don't remember a lot of stuff, but yeah.